Hey guys, we're good. I'm back with another MC5 live, and today I'm gonna be using the T7 of the brand new Marauder class. This gun, man. Gotta tell you, man. First of all, this gun looks insanely cool with this camo. That's first of all. Second of all, this weapon has a faster fire than. Okay then. Um, has a way faster fire than the T6, but the accuracy is a lot worse, if you guys can tell. And with my ability, it'll increase my rate of fire even more, but my accuracy will be even worse. Which is not very ideal, especially with this map. Um, but we're gonna give it a try here. And what's interesting enough is you guys saw that I left I left the game. And then I came back, and oh my god, it's that guy again. You know, and Mr. Wolf is back too, so this is gonna be, uh... You're so good, man. Alright, so let's go ahead and try this. So this is gonna... This is very bad for me because it increases my rate of fire, but my accuracy is a lot worse when I do that. And this gun's accuracy isn't already, it's not good to begin with, so I gotta be very, very close. Which is not very good. Again, with, with this map. Really, dude? You wanna, you wanna just. Dude, this guy almost got me. Anyways, I gotta be very careful and stick to corners. Because honestly, I'm gonna get wrecked if I don't. Literally, yeah, this is what I do. For free for all, since this gun isn't exactly the best, ow, what? The freak just hurt me. Alright then. Very funny. Whoever did that. <laughs> So I'm through a wall or something. I don't know what it was, but anyways, that's what we're gonna. Do. We're just gonna have to stick close to the walls and stuff. So, ow! Oh, that's funny. Very funny. Oh boy. I am honestly screwed, man. Dude, you didn't do any damage to that guy. Come on. You've got to be kidding me. Woo, it's lagging, dude. No! <laughs> 8 HP, dude. 8 HP. My game was lagging hardcore. All right, let's maybe not use that perk for now. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. Okay, then. Oh, boy, there's something behind me. No, no, no. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know if that's a bug, but there's a bit of hitching um, in the game where if you try to turn your screen, kind of like lags for a sec. Which kind of messes up your aim. I think that's new that came in this update. But... Oh, please, dude. Please don't come any closer. Oh, hey, thank you, dude. How did you not die? How did you not kill me? I'll take it, dude. You know, let's actually activate this really quick while I go in here. Ah! Oh god, he's stuck. Get off me, get off me, get off me! Oh, I'm so lucky he was trying to go for the knife. Okay, we're good for now. I don't know where this guy's going. Oh boy. No bueno, dude. Okay. Thank you for the good times, man. Please get off me! Woo! No, that's not gonna work. I don't know what I'm doing. Go away. This is such a bad idea, man. Such a bad idea. Alright, it's alright. We're alive, at least for now. Ah, these guys are wearing the same armor? Why are you only trying to knife me, dude? What? What's your problem? Alright. Well then. 
21 kills, man. I'm pretty happy about myself with this gameplay. But, uh... but yeah, this is literally how you use this gun or this class, man. You get a few shots if you want from a good distance away. If you're not close range, and then just kind of peek back and forth, and it, it just it just works, man. Oh, it's the master sniper, dude! <laughs> It's the freaking master sniper. He's so good. So good. Oh, yeah, I'll be able to get him. Come here, dude. I just want to say hi. Where you at? What's up, Mr. Wolf? Yeah, that's right. You're not going to win this game, dude. That's what I thought, man. That's what I thought. Anyways. <laughs> So that was T7, 25 and 7, not too bad. Um, ooh, well then. Um, anyways, so that is the Zek, which is the T7, and I gotta say, man, I still prefer T5. T5 is just an overall better weapon with better accuracy, and the damage, I just think it's better. Even if it doesn't show it in the stats, regardless of what stats shows or whatever, I prefer T5 all the way. So right now, as of right now, all the tiers that I've tried so far, T5 and the first prestige weapon are the best in this class, honestly. They're the only ones that are, I mean, the T7, it's worth it, but T5 and the first prestige are definitely the best. So now we're going to go ahead and try the Chasm Pole, which is the last prestige weapon. So definitely check out that in the next video. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.